Mr. Maleman, uh, welcome to the Pro Wine 2014. You're from the California Wine Institute and uh, you're representing a lot of people. How many? Well, we represent about a thousand wineries, but we brought about a hundred people here to participate at, uh, at Pro Wine. Why is it so important to be here at the Pro Wine? Why do you have to come here as a winemaker? I think Pro Wine has developed into the trade show to be. Uh, if you want to do business internationally, this is the place to be. And you know, I think that Pro Wine is about 20 years old now, but since four, five, six years, this has really turned into the place to be. And why do you think it? Why? Why is that? Is it because so many people are interna So many international people are here, or is it? Um, is it the place because it's in Dusseldorf, or why do you think it is? I think it's a, a little bit of both. Uh, obviously, it's in Dusseldorf. I think what uh, something that also has to do with it is, is the fact that it's very well organized. It's easy to go to. It's easy to be at. Uh, transportation is great. Hotels are great. The organization is wonderful. And that has attracted the right exhibitors. And that has attracted the right visitors. So that's just a multiplying factor. Um, you've obviously been here quite often. Was there one event or one conversation that you remember that was is distinctive and that was kind of stayed in your head and you think that was a really important or really interesting conversation? Well, I've actually, I think I was at the first Pro Wine ever. Um, at that time you had Interwine and Pro Wine and they merged into one, I think that was about 20 years ago. And uh, we were there, uh, small, and we've grown. And as I said, I think about five or six years ago, that was the tipping point. I don't know exactly what happened, but after that, I mean, we got a lot more interest from our wineries to be here. There have been a lot of trends in the last couple of years, um, al less alcohol in the wines and lots of things. What do you think is the, the trend for the Californian wine? Ooh, that's a tough question. Uh, I think it's not a trend because I think trends come and go like fads, but I think what, what is important for our industry and also for many other industries is the whole sustainable thing. Um, we started really uh, about 10, 15 years ago, and it's, it's, as I always say, sustainability is never a goal, but it's, it's the journey towards the goal. And I think that we keep working on becoming more and more sustainable. That's not really, you know, in terms of, of wine business, the trend, but I think that's, that's important to our industry. And then um, there's uh, people that are experimenting more with Moscato, like the sweeter style wines that is, uh, that is becoming very important. Um, the red blends that we've seen a lot in California. And I think for California specifically, the fact that we are, um, I think the wines are getting more and more elegant, more and more balanced. So I think this quality development is continuing. Well, I must say um, that I'm a little bit jealous of your job. You get to spend time speaking about and tasting wines all day long. So it sounds like a great, a great thing to do. Have a lovely time here in the Pro Wine and um, yeah, enjoy yourself. We will. Thank, you, Thank so you so much. much.